everyone, it's Francis with your Book of Memories. I'm super excited to share this new project I just created. It is actually using a tutorial I already have on my website available, okay? But I did it in the landscape version, so I kind of wanted to show you how you can switch different books up and totally customize them, okay? So of course, let's start out with the beautiful paper line, Rockabye Baby. Designed by Cartabella, just absolutely wonderful. We've got a four by six cut apart page, three by fours, and a cardstock sticker sheet in 12 by 12. I used one and a half packs of these, which these packs come with 12 sheets of 12 by 12 designer cardstock, and it's textured, it's so much fun to use, and I'm just so super excited to share this with you. It is using my Halloween mini album, okay? Some of you will notice. Uh, so I've got a little cut apart right here and I use my envelope punch. <laughs> we are memory keepers little corner punch right here. And then this just is, <laughs> let me just give you a little overview really quick. Okay, this is how it's kind of chunky and I did have this envelope type structure you'll notice. And so it's a magnetic closure. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and pull this down and start right here down at the bottom. I've got like a little twine flower right here and one of the cut aparts I just fussy cut around it. I added a little bit of cotton twine and a ribbon satin pull tab. Got a magnetic closure and an expanding pocket and I used our We Are Memory Keepers envelope punch board to create a notch. Okay, so look at some of the cut aparts here. We've got plenty of photo space. This can hold up to 60 plus. I mean, you can stuff tons of things in here. Okay, this awesome little pouch, I love it. Magnetic closure and that brings us down right here. So I just simply inserted one of these cut aparts and you can go ahead and put a photo right behind there. Look at this little shaker and sweet bundle of joy sticker. Okay, just created this little tuck spot right there. And then this flips down and here's the back. That brings us up to this little tiny flap right here. And you'll notice as you go through the tutorial, um, this is just in the opposite, you know, rotation. So it's totally the landscape version and it's so cute. Got a couple stickers right here and right there. Okay, and I left them open. I just put some cornstarch on the back and just adhered that down. I decided to make like this little <laughs> cotton twine type things. This magnetic pulls down. Okay, and here's a simple pocket. And of course, you customize any type of photo mats or pictures that you want on there. But I just wanted to show you that you can tuck a couple things in this pocket. Super pretty little thing there. And then when that closes, this actually opens up again. And we've got these little bumpers in here. Okay, it's a Kathy King term right there. Beautiful, okay. And then there's a pocket right back here for even more insert space and photo space, okay. Totally customizable. This is a sticker, beautiful five by seven photo spot right there. You just trim it down a little bit. And then that's that portion, okay. So that page is going to flip down now and reveal this. Okay, we got like a little angle page right here, another half page, and then these little sideways envelope. Look at the sideways envelope style, beautiful stickers, places to tuck more four by six photographs in here, bunch of space in these pockets. I mean, look at this, super cute envelope punch board design again, magnetic closure. And I teach you how to do that. And you would just have to use different paper for the tutorial. So it's the Halloween mini album tutorial. Okay, and you can see that on my website. I'll leave a link down below. <laughs> Isn't that cute and simple? Four by six photo spot right there. Be mad perfectly by the white and the craft. Here's a little sticker right there. You could do some journaling. You can even journal on the small photo spots as well. I made another little twine flower there. More stickers. And then here's a cool little, another access from the right side. Okay, we got a four by six photo frame right in here. But I just decided to put a little cut apart in there to show you. Super cute little sticker. You flip that down, place for a picture. More picture space cute stickers, design paper strips, little more stickers. And then this, this one I did a little bit different. This one has a little cut apart right there. Excuse me, that is a sticker. This folds down. Okay, and again, it repeats. And I show you how to make this whole thing. And this goes up and again, it reveals this super cute little addition. And again, you can fit tons of pictures in there. And look at this beautiful paper. And then there's a pocket as well for even a customized insert to go in the large page pocket. And then you flip this down, there's a little corner pocket right here. And we can put this in any orientation. This can be over here, over there, totally any which way that you want it to be. And you can put journaling right there. And here's a beautiful place just to admire the paper. Um, look at that long little scripture there. 
And that is my Halloween mini album style, but not using Halloween paper, of course. Did I forget to mention, these pockets fold down and reveal more photo space. Just awesome, isn't it? Super cute. And this is something that came together in one single day for me. Can you believe it? Just a few hours and I was on my way. So thank you everyone so much for watching. I'll leave the link down below to my tutorial. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.